So I guess we're supposed to trust Trump because he's a liar. You voted against Hillary because she's a liar, but I'm supposed to trust Trump because he lied in his campaign to get elected, and he doesn't really mean what he said during his campaign, so I shouldn't worry. Yes, I should trust Trump because he's a liar. Don't worry about Trump. He'll learn soon enough that he can't actually do hardly any of the things he wants to do, and therefore he shouldn't be a worry. Except for the things that he can do, like get religious fucktards as Supreme Court justices who want to undo most of the progress we've made in the past 60 years. Because, you know, states' rights. Let's have different parts of the country have completely different sets of rules. Yes, we should be the untied states of America instead of the United States of America, because that's somehow a good method of bringing people together as a country. But, you know, nothing to worry about, because he really just wants what's best for the country. He wants to create a registry for Muslims, but we shouldn't worry about that, because there's nothing wrong with doing things that lead to internment camps. Internment camps are all American. They're great, right? N nothing to worry about there, right? I suppose Megyn Kelly is just an SJW for speaking against a registry for Muslims. I guess she doesn't really care about Americans because Muslims aren't really Americans or something like that, right? The Great Divider declares himself as the Great Uniter because propping up the ignorant and uneducated and in many cases the most unintelligent people no matter how provably bigoted they are, is just fine. They're great people, and to quote Trump himself, they're the smartest people. And if they do bad things, he can just say, stop it. And that's enough to stop our country's bigotry ball that used to be underground from continuing to roll somehow. The words stop it are really powerful and they, they work because virtue signaling is very powerful. But as I said, I guess we should trust Trump because he's a liar. Because liars on the right who align with bigotry that used to be underground are much better than liars on the left who want things to be decent for everyone and not just straight white males. And on a social level, we're going to somehow stop black on white crime by demonizing black people more than we already have in the past because demonizing minorities brings us together more and stops minorities from demonizing the majority, somehow. In some twisted alternate reality. The people who want revenge on the demographic that has most often been the one that oppresses minorities will somehow stop wanting revenge if we make their lives even worse than they currently are. Somehow. Yes. Hillary is a liar, therefore Trump's lies are things that should make us trust him. Because lies are only bad if the person promotes leftist values, or something like that, right? But you know, we should just wait and see, because the left has supposedly went full retard in their fears about Trump. Hate crimes going up, well that's meaningless, because there's actually no such thing as hate crimes, and we can't blame those hate crimes on the cultures that were usually underground before Trump rose into popularity. Trump has nothing to do with that, somehow, because he said the phrase, stop it. That makes it all better, so we should stop demonizing Trump for the things he has said, because they're just lies, and we should trust him for being a liar. But you know, I guess we've gone full retard, right? <laughs>